Soya, it's everywhere. From tofu to veggie burgers and beyond, soy milk to protein bars and more, it seems like a health food hero to many. But behind this healthy image lies a darker, hidden truth. Soya production is linked to environmental destruction and potential health risks. This essay will expose the hidden costs of soya and empower you to make informed choices. Get ready to discover the real truth about soya. The Amazon rainforest, the lungs of our planet, is under attack. One of the biggest culprits, soya production. Vast swaths of rainforest are cleared to make way for soya plantations. This deforestation has devastating consequences for wildlife, indigenous communities, and the global climate. The use of harmful pesticides and fertilizers on these plantations further pollutes the environment. These chemicals contaminate water sources, damage soil health, and threaten biodiversity. Choosing sustainably sourced soya is crucial to protect this precious ecosystem. Soya contains compounds called isoflavones which act like estrogen in the body. While some studies suggest that isoflavones may have benefits like reducing menopausal symptoms, others raise concerns. The impact of soya on hormone-sensitive conditions like thyroid disorders and breast cancer is still debated. The scientific evidence is mixed and more research is needed. However, it's clear that consuming large amounts of processed soya products may not be beneficial for everyone. Moderation in choosing whole soya foods over processed ones is key. Who needs to be extra careful with soya? While moderate soya consumption is generally considered safe for most adults, certain groups should be more cautious. This includes individuals who may have specific health conditions or are at different stages of life. Infants fed soy-based formula may be exposed to high levels of isoflavones, which are plant-based compounds that can mimic estrogen. This exposure could potentially impact their hormonal development and overall growth. People with hypothyroidism need to be particularly mindful of their soya intake. Soya can interfere with the body's ability to produce thyroid hormones, which are crucial for regulating metabolism and energy levels. Women with breast cancer, especially those with estrogen receptor positive tumors, should consult their doctors about soya consumption. Soya contains phytoestrogens, which may stimulate tumor growth in some cases. It's essential to get personalized medical advice. Additionally, elderly individuals and those on multiple medications should also be cautious. Soya can interact with various medications, potentially altering their effectiveness. Always consult with a healthcare provider to ensure safe consumption. Don't be fooled. Some argue that Asian cultures have consumed soya for centuries without ill effects. They point to the long history of soya in traditional Asian diets as evidence that it is safe and beneficial. However, this argument is misleading. It overlooks important differences in how soya is consumed and processed. Traditional Asian diets use fermented soya products which are different from the processed soya commonly found in Western diets. Fermentation changes the nutritional profile of soya, making it easier to digest and less likely to cause health issues. Furthermore, Asian populations consume far less soya than Westerners, and their diets are rich in other healthy foods. They eat a balanced diet that includes a variety of vegetables, fish, and rice, which contributes to their overall health. The Asian paradox doesn't give soya a free pass. It highlights the importance of context and the way foods are prepared and consumed. We need to look at the bigger picture and consider the type and quantity of soya consumed. Not all soya products are created equal, and moderation is key to maintaining a healthy diet. Navigating the Soya Maze With soya lurking in so many processed foods, it's difficult to know what to choose. From snacks to ready meals, soya can be found in a variety of forms, often hidden under different names. Look for products with clear labeling and opt for organic, non-GMO soya whenever possible. These labels ensure that the soya is free from genetic modifications and grown without harmful pesticides. Choose whole soya foods like edamame, tempeh, which are minimally processed and retain most of their natural nutrients, and tofu over highly processed meat alternatives. These whole foods are versatile and can be used in a variety of dishes from salads to stir-fries. Support companies committed to sustainable soya production and look for certifications like the Roundtable on Responsible Soy or RTRS. These certifications indicate that the soya is produced in an environmentally friendly and socially responsible manner. Consider exploring alternative protein sources like lentils, chickpeas, which are not only nutritious but also versatile in cooking, and beans to reduce your reliance on soya. These alternatives can provide a rich source of protein and other essential nutrients, making your diet more diverse and balanced. Demand better, choose wisely. 
The future of soya depends on responsible production and informed consumption. We need to demand transparency from food companies and support sustainable farming practices. Educate yourself about the impacts of soya production and make conscious choices. By choosing sustainably sourced soya products, reducing our overall meat consumption, and supporting alternative protein sources, we can create a healthier planet and healthier lives. Let's make a difference. One soya bean at a time. And before you go, thank you so much for watching our video and please make sure to subscribe to our channel. If you want to lower your blood pressure naturally, watch the video on your screen next.